Peace and blessings, beautiful people. Peace and blessings. This is Empress Imani, and welcome to this episode of Sacred Love Lessons. The divine whispers in the quiet moments. It's in our stillness that we often hear the loudest truths. Barbara O'Neill. I'm Empress Imani, inspirational teacher of Sacred Love Lessons. I help women to honor the love within so they too can manifest the life of their dreams. We're in season five, Be Your Own Guru, 12 Secrets of the Sacred Seba. Our objective today is to expand our spiritual wisdom and tap into a higher level of consciousness. But before we start, let's invoke our goddess energy of Asherah. Asherah, known as She Who Enriches, is a mother goddess of fertility, divine knowledge, and wisdom. Her symbols include the tree of life, flowers, and cows. She is also known as the queen of gods and the ruler of heaven and is associated with the soul star chakra. The soul star chakra is located six inches above the head, just outside the physical body. It is our connection to our higher self and contains the essence and power of our accumulated soul experiences throughout lifetimes. The soul star chakra is associated with the color white and is composed of etheric energy that resonates at 1074 hertz, 1074 hertz. It is known as the eternal flame that burns forever. The soul star chakra represents our connection to the divine, our inner goddess, and higher realms of consciousness. Think of this chakra as the storage unit for our soul. It holds all the memories, information of our past lives, and our soul's past elements. It is in this chakra that we access our Akashic records and find our blueprints, soul contracts, and sacred purpose. A gateway to enlightenment and ascension, the soul star chakra connects us to other dimensions and worlds beyond the physical realm. We can communicate with angels and ascended masters. When our soul star chakra is out of balance, we may feel a lack of purpose, anxiety, mistrust, and a sense of being disconnected, lost, and attached. When our soul star chakra is balanced, it brings a deep sense of inner peace, divine connection, and alignment with our higher selves. We may experience intense intuition, renewed inspiration, a true understanding of our life's purpose, along with an abundance of energy to fully experience a good life. Some benefits of tapping into the soul star chakra frequency include, number one, you experience enhanced intuition and knowing. Two, you know your sacred purpose with an increased desire to live with conviction. Three, you know universal truths. Four, you experience the energy of oneness. The divine light that enters through the soul star chakra not only fuels our souls, but fuels the lower seven chakras. So how do we access the soul star frequency? The first thing that we can do to access the soul star frequency is to embrace the energy of peace and openness. Two, meditate and visualize divine white light. Three, listen to music at 1074 hertz or spend time in silence. Number four, use crystal energy. Some crystals that I recommend for the soul star chakra include clear quartz, moldavite, and selenite. Number five, ask your inner goddess for help. Number six, ask your angels and ascended masters for help. Questions to ponder. Where am I now and what shift is calling to me? Where am I now and what shift is calling to me. Number two, how can I open myself to the endless possibilities of life? How can I open myself to the endless possibilities of life? And number three, 
How do I access my Akashic Records? These are some questions to ponder when speaking with your inner goddess or speaking to your angels and ascendant masters. These are some questions that you can ponder. I have an exercise for you today. I borrowed it from Ernest Holmes. It's called flipping the switch, flipping the switch. So the first thing you want to do is close your eyes. Then take a deep breath. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Then picture a light switch in your mind. This switch represents your connection to the divine. Now flip the switch on. Visualize a surge of warm golden energy flowing into you. Feel it filling every cell of your body, lighting you up from the inside out. This is your goddess-given power being elevated. Take a deep breath. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. This is called flipping the switch. Anytime you need boosted energy, it's like a power pellet or anything like that. When you find yourself in a situation where you need more than you feel that you have, all you have to do is turn the power switch on and feel your goddess-given power elevate within you. Affirmation. I am one with my inner goddess in all that is. I am in tune with the frequency of universal consciousness and divine wisdom flows through me. I live in my sacred purpose and I shine my light daily. I am one with my inner goddess and all that is. I am in tune with the frequency of universal consciousness and divine wisdom flows through me. I live in my sacred purpose and I shine my light daily. I'll leave you with this final thought. You have the power to expand your perception beyond linear time. You can align with the version of you that is already experiencing the reality you desire. You can live in purpose, on purpose. The power is yours. So that's what I have for you today. Thank you for listening to this episode of Sacred Love Lessons. Be your own guru, 12 Secrets of the Sacred Saba. Wherever you're tuning in in the world, don't forget to click that like, comment, and subscribe. And until we speak again, be the light.